All right, folks, welcome back to what might be the most entertaining YouTube video of all time. Probably not, but we are on a mission today. Ashley has sent me out on a solo mission. We sold a bunch of clubs on Whatnot yesterday, and we are out of packing tape, so we're headed over to Walmart to go find some tape. I promise there'll be more entertaining things, but I figured I would take you along and see what we're uh, doing for the day. We'll show you what sold and all of that. Also talk about kind of like our plans. We have a big road trip coming up. We have our 200,000 subscribers special on the main channel as well, which involves the road trip. But uh, yeah, lots of uh, fun stuff coming up. But first, a trip to Walmart for packing tape. I promise you it's gonna be a very entertaining video and we are starting off with a banger. Might as well check out the golf section while we are here. This is uh, interesting, $50 for a uh, belt kit right here. I feel like the ones at uh, Nike are less expensive and that's kind of uh, interesting. Got the uh, tee up golf things. We should do a, a challenge on the uh, main channel with that or these flat balls. We've done a birdie ball, the uh, limited flight golf balls. We've done a challenge on that, Ashley uh, beat me. It was kind of a funny, the uh, winner got to choose where we went to lunch and we were both gonna choose Waffle House, so we were definitely uh, both winners there. Search and Rescue, the most important club in the bag, best golf joke of all time. I'm so bad at golf that I had to regrip my ball retriever. These jokes are way more funny when uh, Ashley is uh, here. It's a little flat so far. <laughs> I promise Ashley will be in the uh, video in a little bit. We got a uh, TaylorMade RBZ Tech glove. This place has a bunch of uh, golf stuff in here. I got a bunch of Vice clubs too. It's kind of interesting that Vice is like a uh, kind of a cool brand, but they still sell it at Walmart. They got a golf, yeah, sometimes you can find the uh, Vice uh, golf balls on clearance here. We'll go check out the uh, clearance section here in a second. If you guys are OG members of the original channel, one of our first videos ever to do well was the uh, review of the uh, Nitro golf ball, the pink one. I'll uh, link to that if you guys want to uh, see. That was a video without Ashley. This is like the only video we've done since then that hasn't had uh, Ashley in it. Ooh, well, we got like a GPS thing in here as well. These are all the uh, golf balls that people have uh, taken out of the uh, other dozens. A lot of uh, Walmarts around here will have these things like in cases because people will switch out, especially if it's like the same brand. They'll like switch out the cheaper ones like the uh, Super Softs and put them in the uh, Chrome Softs. So uh, be on the lookout if you are uh, buying golf balls at Walmart, people will switch them out. This used to be a clearance section. No clearance today. We'll go check out the clearance section actually. There might be some golf stuff in there. Oh, the clearance section is loaded. Let's see if there's any golf things. Oh, here we go. We got the... Uh, PGA Tour Essentials. Those are some giant tees. They're like martini tees. Got, what is this? A, a batter's helmet clip. I'm not seeing it. Oh, we got some uh, zero friction golf balls. I've tried the zero friction gloves. They're uh, pretty good, but I uh, have not tried the uh, golf balls. I think this is owned by the same company that uh, owns the uh, nitros. Let's see if it tells you right here. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. No, it doesn't tell you that, but I'm pretty sure that's the uh, same company that owns uh, Nitro Golf Balls. Oh, we got some uh, Odyssey Putter covers on clearance, $16.40. They have the uh, mallet covers too. Yeah, they got some of the uh, mallet covers back there as well. It's not a bad deal on that. Got the tee it up foam golf balls in the American colorway, or I guess it could be many a country's uh, colorways right there, right next to the Pioneer Woman. $2.98, I feel like that would be a uh, good deal on that. It was $3.98, yeah, not that great of a deal. I look very dapper in that. Oh, we got the uh, RBZ Tech gloves in sale in here and some, oh, there's a whole section of golf stuff. I didn't even see this. Got the uh, Callaway uh, head covers, Wilson towel, Vice golf towel. This place is loaded. Huh, Callaway uh, hybrid head cover right there. Got the uh, tees. These are like the same exact thing as the other ones. How much are these? 440 versus 410 and you get two small tees to go along with it. There you go. I don't know what the uh, deal is with the PGA Tour stuff. It seems like expensive when you can get like name brand stuff like Nike and Callaway for uh, less expensive. But, oh man, this is kind of a cool. A uh, Caddyshack towel. Interesting. I feel like I've seen that before, but let's see if there's any other golf stuff down here. I found a Vice golf bag once in here. It was like 50% off. We found a TaylorMade bag in here too. I don't even know how that got in there because they don't even sell TaylorMade bags most of the time. It must've been like an online return or something like that. $23.77 on a classic lamp. There you go. Well, this has been a classic video so far. Let's go see if we can find some packing tape. Well, how convenient is that? The uh, aisle next to the clearance section is the one with the packing tape. Uh, she said to get the refills only. Oh, here we go. Easy starts, packing tape. Oh, I'm gonna choose wrong and I'm gonna get in trouble. Heavy duty, seems like guaranteed state. I, I need something with a guarantee on there. There you go, $16.98 versus, oh, man. but Ashley loves a deal. Well, these are the same people that make duct tape. We saw Carhartt duct tape the other day at a uh, garage sale. Should have bought that. 1268 versus 1248. General purpose, heavy duty. I think for 40 cents extra, we're gonna go with heavy duty. Is it the same yardage? Oh no, that one's twice. 
Yeah. Like, or, yeah. Hopefully Ashley watches this and approves. So, oh man, I just slipped, put a hole in there. Yeah. See if we can get a scratch and dent <laughs> discount. This is the most pinatas I've ever seen at a Walmart. This is amazing. It's not just this aisle over here. <laughs> this whole thing is uh, filled with them as well. You know, if you need a pinata, this is the Walmart to uh, go to. Oh, this is amazing. When you're on the checkout aisle, they've got beef jerky, which you would expect to see. You got flaming hot Cheetos. You got some uh, candy bars, but check these out. Little on the go Cholula hot sauces. That's amazing. Definitely gotta pick up that. Never know where you're gonna need some hot sauce. Keep that in the fanny pack. All right, a successful first stop. We managed to procure the packing tape and some hot sauce, which <laughs> uh, will definitely come in handy. I kind of feel like I'm cheating on Ashley right now, going to a Goodwill without her. Watch this be the time that we find a uh, Scotty Cameron at a Goodwill. We've never found one. We found them at garage sales, flea markets, pawn shops, pretty much everywhere, but a thrift store. And this one <laughs> hopefully is uh, not the day, but there is a uh, Goodwill right next to the uh, post office that we're gonna go to here in a little bit. So Ashley won't go with uh, out Goodwill for the entire day. She's just not going with us in this one. Whoa. Oh, tons of clubs in here. We got a Sun Mountain bag right here for $45.99. Usually if they price it, uh, the bag, then the uh, clubs are included. Oh man, we got a uh, Cobra Bio Cell. Got a Mizuno JPX 855 iron. What are these? I've never seen these, the Equalizer, not Ben Hogan's. Uh, we got a uh, TaylorMade midsize over here. Man, we got so many clubs in here. We got a, uh, this is a, speaking of Odyssey head cover. Oh yeah, this is the uh, Callaway Solaire. Man, a Callaway Solaire butter ate a Goodwill. Got the uh, newer Golf Pride sensor grip in there. That is super cool. I think this is a B60. Yeah, ping B60. What in the world? Oh, it's also got the uh, Golf Ball Retriever thing at the uh, top of it. Got a uh, King Cobra FP 4 iron. Man, this is like a, tr oh, I think there might actually be a full set of these uh, JPX irons. I see another one in here. This is the uh, six. So we got the five and the six. Got another Cobra Bio Cell. These ones are individually uh, priced. Hopefully that means that all of them are individually priced. Sometimes they make you buy the entire bag and you'll end up with like a bunch of like random clubs that you don't want. Still got that Fila driver in here. Man, that would have been like an all time find if we found the entire set of uh, JPXs. But here, where are the, uh, the, the five iron? We actually just found a, a gap wedge of this <laughs> on the uh, main channel and I chipped in with it. So I am a fan of those two, I say the least. Got different uh, shafts in there. Kind of uh, interesting if we found the uh, whole bag of it though. Got some uh, ladies big berthas. Oh, I didn't even notice this. We got a tailor-made ATV grind wedge. That is, what's under this little head cover? Oh, got too many clubs. I don't know what to do all by myself, as you guys can tell by the video so far. What is this? Ah, it's not worth getting. Get the uh, B60, is that one individually priced? We'll go up there and ask. Whatever the most expensive one is, well, that's what we'll pay for uh, all of them. That's usually what uh, ends up happening. Get the Solaire putter as well. And this is the part where Ashley usually points out something that I'm missing and don't need the King Cobra FP, but the JPXs are definitely worth it. Oh, and the uh, bio cell. Cool. Well, that was a successful little trip right there. Good thing we didn't find a Scott camera. That would've been terrible to uh, find without uh, Ashley. There you go, I got Ashley a putter. Callaway Solaire, world's greatest putter. Uh, see if we can manage. Yes, thumbnail. Man, this Goodwill just keeps giving. We got some uh, Yak Leather Echo Golf Shoes. I have no hands to uh, show you them though. We got some uh, Roshi Nikes. What else we got over here? See if there's any other golf shoes. Got some Lacoste shoes down there. I didn't know that, but apparently Daniel Berger, who's a PGA Tour player, his family is like of the Lacoste like line or something like that. They used to be like really big into uh, tennis like a lot of his family. But uh, oh, the valuables case over here before I give you uh, more useless info. Oh, we got some Penny Hardaways. These things are cool on the uh, tongue or whatever the back part is that is called. I am this one cent. That is cool. He is 49 cents short of 50, which is 50 cents short of a dollar. That was a weird rap, uh, reference as well. I got some Air Force Ones in here. How much are those going for? $55. Well, no uh, shoes worth picking up, but uh, definitely got some uh, golf clubes worth picking up. There you go, thumbnail. Oh, let's go show Ashley our finds. Ah, there we go. Hello, oh, hello. I got you something. I want some Goodwill without you. <laughs> we'll go to another one later, I promise. <laughs> oh, you got like a bouquet without yes, me. You brought also, me a bouquet of golf clubs home. A bouquet of golf clubs better than uh, <laughs> flowers. Also, we get to go to Lula, which I'm super excited about. And I got the tape. Just little ball. Thank you very yeah, much. I got you a putter though. Check it out. With a head cover? You never see head covers at Goodwill. No, that's pretty crazy. Ladies too. Yes. Nice. Oh, I didn't even check that out. It's almost like the uh, old school number seven. Before cool. the uh, Luke Donald one, the one with the uh, fangs, this mm -hmm. was the uh, number seven series of the uh, White Hot. Huh, 
And it's got the Atur sensor. Fancy. Fancy for sure. Got some uh, bio cells. Couple of Mizuno. Yeah, Mizuno JPX, an old school classic, the Ping B60. You did good Thank on you. your little side quest. My side quest. <laughs> <laughs> the addition of tape results in. There you go. No, that's the thumbnail right there. All right, let's get this uh, stuff all packed up. Sweet. And then uh, we'll head out to the uh, post office and another Goodwill. With me this time. Yeah, it's gonna be people are, have all dropped off or they've right? just scrolled through to the this moment Gosh. right here. It was painful to do it all by myself. It's nerve wracking. Yeah. Even with the two of us, it's still pretty nerve wracking. No, you just make everything better. The star of the show is here. Now let's uh, get to work. <laughs> well, John got to have all the fun. Now I get to do all the work. But you guys ask a lot how we ship clubs and this for hybrids. I'm gonna show you how this works. Iron sets are a whole different beast, so that'll probably be its own video one day because they are um, very interesting to ship. But first off, packing tape. We actually get boxes from Uline. It's what we found is the cheapest so far. This is the four by four by 48, and then you have to cut them down just a little bit. All right, step number one is building the box. Are you learning how to do it for <laughs> <Yeah>. me? <laughs> John packed a box like last time we did a whatnot auction and you were like, man, this is really complicated. <laughs> I used to ship when I was in like college and everything. I used to ship like tons all and tons of clubs all the time, but I haven't done it in a while. Ashley doesn't let me do it because she packs it way better than I do. Yeah, I've kind of gotten the art form down, but we have a, we sold a Ping G2517 hybrid. And so like the box, like sizing wise, it fits pretty well in there, but you just obviously want to make sure it doesn't rattle. Around. Yeah, so you just throw it in a bunch of that paper. This is all like recycled stuff too. Yeah. The main thing is you don't want it to uh, rattle and you want to protect the uh, head mm -hmm. and the uh, grip and then the shaft you just put a bunch of stuff so it doesn't like hit the box and stuff. Yep. I think that sold for $30 yes. and I think we paid about $30 for that. I used it for a while. Oh, so. it's going back up to Indiana too. Oh, nice. Fellow Hoosier. Right. Have I'm you tried the flavor yet? Oh, um, no. Technical difficulties. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you okay? Almost kind of took it out. Oh, oh, my God. God. Not Have you tried this flavor yet? Watermelon, war yeah, Warheads Sour Watermelon. Oh, good. It's very good. Also, there's no sugar in it, but it tastes like straight sugar. Yeah, I remember one of their flavors. It's very bizarre. I'm trying to help. Make yeah, it look my like first I do. Yeah. Ashley packs, and then I uh, edit all the videos. That we usually do them at the same time. So it's like, yeah, yeah cool. we're both being productive. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Alright, and then I have some just like regular track paper too, which is what John was talking about. That you just put this down in here so everything doesn't rattle around. Mm -hmm. And if you read our reviews on whatnot, everybody compliments the uh, packaging. So that's all Ashley's. I take great uh, pride in No that. one compliments my editing, but everybody compliments <laughs> Ashley's. Uh... <laughs> yes. Alright, I need a little bit more packaging. And then you see like there's actual like extra room so you cut it down as well, which you can use. I use this when the camera's not on an X-Acto knife, but I'll use scissors for safety today. The pressure <laughs> Maybe of recording. because John is bad luck when it comes to sharp objects. I guess this is a hybrid kind of day. We already packed up a bunch of stuff, but these are the only ones that are remaining. Yeah. We got the uh, Strixon ZX2 hybrid. Uh, this thing is an absolute rock launcher. If you're looking for something that's like a replacement of a fairway wood, uh, if you like, don't hit fairway woods, Good. And you want something that's really long, this is really good. It's basically just like a three wood uh, loft or a four wood loft. That sold for like $125, I think. And then we also have a, a Callaway Rogue X3 hybrid, which I think sold for like $75. So uh, pretty good deals all, all around on that. Especially that Pink G25, that on eBay usually goes for like uh, 80 to, uh, like usually like 80 to $100, mm -hmm. but we let it go for 30 bucks. This stuff was on our uh, Buy It Now. Uh, we haven't had time to do an auction in a while, so we just threw stuff. Yeah, we're trying to. We're still trying to figure out whatnot because it's a new platform, so well, the buy it now seems to be pretty good. Yeah, yeah, because it shows that there's something on the store. Because some people didn't realize it was an auction site, so they went to the store. Yeah, if you and like go like, to our thing hey. and you don't know what whatnot is, it looks like we have zero in our store, but usually we do auctions, so, so like yeah, everything's everything, selling. It's at all one live. Time. Yeah. So we figured try buy it now for now. Give a little auction too. A little auction. Everybody's judging you. <laughs> or they're muggles; they can't see. There you go. It's perfect. And then you just like cut it down to size. And then the next step is the thank you note, yes. which is the main importance. Let's see. I'll hand it. I see like uh, other YouTubers; they like have like the same printed out one, but we always like doing the. Yeah, I one. think the handwritten one helps a lot. 
Your handwriting, not mine. <laughs> yes, not John. Nobody wants John's handwriting. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see who this is going to. This is going to Dustin. Sweet. Dustin in Indiana. Thank you. Every single Dustin in Indiana, thank you. Yes, every single one of you. <laughs> and then we just have, what is our uh, label printer thing called? It's a Rolo. Rolo, yeah. That thing is super nice because you don't have to pay for ink. It's just like the, what are those things called? Uh, heat label? Heat, heat label printer. Yeah, heat label printer. Sorry, you distracted me. I'm easily distracted and I distract people often. And there we go. You should leave this all unedited. <laughs> Sorry, it does take a minute. There you go. Oh, I'm just messy. Handwritten thank you note goes in here. Then you cut these down to size. And she's good to go. All the way back up to Indiana. Sweet. Well, we'll tape that up, and then we will meet you at the post office and the next Goodwill. We will wrap up this scene right now. All right, second Goodwill of the day. Hopefully it is just as productive as the first one. Now that we got the uh, star of the show here, it's gonna be twice as good, even if we don't find any clubs, because you're far more entertaining than I am. Yeah, that might be true. Debatable. That might be true, thanks. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I don't think I've ever been this jealous of a Goodwill find ever. Not only do we have some big Lebowski jelly shoes, but check these out. Ashley size. Healy's. Oh my goodness. My, uh, trip to the ER. Trip to the <laughs> ER, indeed. Man, and the bearings, I've, I've seen people like try these on after like years and then they get stuck and they just fall right over. Oh. Oh, oh this is a bad idea. <laughs> That's a bad idea. You're right out of the uh, crack too. Uh, Enjoy yeah, I don't think that's the uh, smartest thing to uh, buy, but there are uh, no golf clubs worth uh, picking up in here. But hopefully, you guys did pick up this video and enjoy it. But hopefully, you guys did like this video. If you did, like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. See you next time. A little day in the life. There you go. Oh man, you got Grogu socks on. This Sweet. This is the way. This is the way. You got Grogu. You got <laughs> Harry Potter. Interesting outfit. Mickey today. Mouse uh, fanny pack. I'm all some, over the place. You need those Betty Boops to go with I'm it. I am all over the place, just like this video. Yeah. Hopefully, you guys did like this uh, video. Day in the life of uh, stack golf. Very interesting. Very interesting to us, at least. But I hope you guys like this video. If you like, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. See you next time. Somehow we're getting close to 25,000 subscribers on this channel. So if you want to be uh, tortured, also I'm just dragging this on so <laughs> Ashley keeps on waving torturing. If you want to be uh, tortured uh, almost daily, almost daily. Yeah. Then More subscribe. More frequently. More frequently. Okay, bye. This is a frequent trip to the uh, ER. But I hope you guys like this video. If you like, and subscribe. And we'll see you, we'll see you next time. time.